Second day for our recognition at the World Defense Show 2022 near Riyadh, Saudi Arabia. This first edition is very interesting, not only because we have at the same location at the same time Ukrainian and Russian exhibitors, which is in the current situation is quite sensitive, but we also have a lot of small companies beside the major exhibitors we used to see everywhere. And some Saudi companies definitely present some surprising products. My name is Adil. I'm the owner of House of Universal Motorcycle. I've been in this field for a very, very long time. From entertainment car to a military car. It's a missile launcher. We can uh, adapt a short range anti-drone missile on it. We can deal with any threat with low altitude. It's very fast moving. It can go to the worst areas, which is the big cars cannot reach. We chose the Canam platform because uh, we believe that for the time being Canam is number one. The engine is very strong and it's very durable. So uh, we decided to put our idea on the Canam X3 Turbo with the three cylinder turbo, 195 horsepower. It's very light car. It has very strong torque. So this is one of the reasons that we chose the X3 Canam. This is a six by six vehicle. It's also the platform we are using, the Canon platform. The idea of this one, sometimes your mission it needs for the troops to run it to 20 to 25 kilometers with a light equipment. So you can go to the harshest area and you can do your mission. You can put a gun here, it depends to the gun that you want. This is one of the good ideas and hopefully it will come on the ground. I'm uh, Ted Wright. I am the CEO of Navistar Defense. Would you mind please introduce yourself? Yes, please. My name is Abdullah Al Amil, and I'm the chairman of Iraf Industrial Company. Well, we've signed a contract, a partner, for Navistar Defense to supply the development of our vehicle to our partner here in Saudi Arabia, where this vehicle will be assembled. The transfer of the know-how and the technology is the main purpose. It is fulfilling the requirements of the government of Saudi Arabia to bring know -how, military know-how to the country. So we are presenting uh, the truck, for example, and also we are in continuous cooperation with Navistar for any future developments that have a market here. This vehicle has been sold to the U.S. Army. 9,000 vehicles are with the U.S. Army. The uh, UAE also has a thousand vehicles and needs a thousand more. So yeah, this this vehicle is sold all over the world. Near Riyadh, we have a facility of about uh, 40,000 square meter area with about 7,000 square meter covered area. And uh, we are one of the actually three oldest company in armoring in Saudi Arabia. Since 95, we have started the business. An MRAP is a mine protected vehicle. So this vehicle is the most protected uh, vehicle in the world that's on wheels. And so it protects soldiers' lives. Uh, we protected thousands of American soldiers' lives in uh, Afghanistan. So we think it's the perfect product to protect soldiers' lives here in Saudi Arabia as well. This is a six by six military truck. So it's a multi-purpose vehicle to carry containers, to carry uh, uh, equipment, to carry radars, communication equipment, etc. So it is generally a utility vehicle. We formed a great relationship and uh, that relationship is built on trust. So I think we trust each other and it's a wonderful relationship. And the second thing is the capabilities. We have the capabilities of a design and the development of a world-class truck. They have the capability to build and assemble this truck here in Saudi Arabia, so it was a perfect match. My name is Mansour Abul Khair from company Al Muraba System Muraba, and today we would like to show you one of the projects related to the joint venture we have it between Jordan and Saudi Arabia. Today we have a vehicle 4x4, which is special for uh, internal tactical vehicle. We would like to also to explain about the remote weapon station. Here we have the weapons, which is M2 Browning 50 cal 12.7. Also, it can be integrated with the 762 by NATO standard. Additional for that, we have many function which is related to tracking. How I can shoot, uh, for example, 10 target in one click. All this uh, function it's available now in our system. The system can be used uh, in the three method, joystick and mouse. Also, we can use it by screen touch. The system, as you see, we have a fully co confirmation for the cameras, which is cameras we are using. We have uh, the stabilization during, you know, the, the, the movement and the tracking and the block to the target. We 
have the laser range finder where you can recognize what the distance between us and the target. Also the temperature, outside temperature and the speed of wind and the pressure. Shooting at 10 target in one time, what we are doing, we assign the target. We already got all the targeted. What we are doing, we will move the safety and we will start the auto shooting. Mission is done and we have fully shooting targeted.